child. It is hot in here. But as you guessed from the title of the video, we're going to be talking all about boobs and bras. So ladies, you can take notes. Fellas, you can take notes for your ladies. So let's begin. First off, I think I'm a little overdressed for the occasion. So look away, little ones. Look away. I'm going to be taking off just my top and discussing different types of bras. So I am a 46 triple D. I have a lot of weight on my boobs, so I need support, and I need a lot of it. So this bra right here is really good for support. You see the thickness of the shoulder band? So if you have weight on you, you don't want those little bitty thin, I mean, I know you're trying to look cute for your man, or your girl, or yourself, but you don't want the bras with them little bitty, like, thin spaghetti down there looking strap um straps for your bra you want support so you want the thick band and as you can see this is full figured it goes all the way and when you turn to the side here it's full figured now you're going to see the difference between the bras that I put on and if like the fat like spills over on the bra and if it doesn't like this is a really good support bra you see how it has one two three i think it has four there we go there we go okay you see it has four band i mean four um little clips that's what you want if you're a big chested woman you do not want two actually you don't even want three or less I get either four or five clips onto my bra and this is like the best bra I have it gives me all the support that I need I have no complaints none whatsoever with this bra you guys so yes this is going to be the winner. Now, I'm going to show you what you don't want in a bra, as well as what you do want in a bra. And then I'm going to show you the strapless bras. We're going to get it together. Just stay tuned. I'll be back. 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 All right, I'll be back. Okay, now this bra I bought because I was trying to be cute. Now, it has no support. Look how thin the straps are for one. There is no underwire. So, they basically just sag. <laughs> I don't like that. It does have four clips in the back, but because it doesn't have anything here, there's no support. And it's going to start digging into my shoulders. As you can see, some of the bras have already started digging in my shoulders. You see that? The dark spot there? That's from my bras because my boobs are so big. So what I usually do... As I shop at Lane Bryan, Catherine's, Avenue, I can't shop at places like Victoria's Secret and Fenty X. 
because my breasts are too big. So I do what works for me. And this bra doesn't. But I just wanted to show you ladies, this isn't it. If you have the weight at the bottom of your boobs, like all my weight is down here. All my weight is down here. So I need something with a, either an underwire or something that's gonna be more lifting or a full support. Because as you can see the cleavage here, so you know your boobs aren't being fully supported. Now if it was like this, then yeah, they're being fully supported because you don't hardly see any cleavage. But because they just sag, th this isn't what you want ladies. You don't want support like this, especially if you have big breasts. Because of my breasts, I have back issues. I don't want to go through the surgery. Actually, I can't afford the surgery. Um, they look at it as cosmetic and not as needed with me. So that's a whole nother story. But anyway, ladies, this, no. The first one I had on, yes. So I'm going to do a 360 of this bra. So it's the front. You see how there's just, there are four here, but I just feel like it just doesn't do anything for support. I don't know. I just, like when I run up and down the stairs, because um, this is a two-level story house. But um, when I run up and down the stairs, this bra right here gives me no support. I go running up and down the stairs, and I, I feel like they're going to fall out of my skin and just start rolling on the ground. So no, you don't want this. But I will be back with another bra that is very supportive. And I believe it is full coverage. And it has the, the straps. Those are so important, ladies. Ladies, those are so important when you have big breasts. Because it's going to dig. The, the weight of your breast is going to make it dig. And, and once it starts digging, then you're going to have grooves. You see, I have grooves. So I had to learn the hard way. I'm still learning, actually. I'm not gonna even lie, I'm still learning. But I've learned enough where I feel like I can come on camera and tell you ladies, if you have big breasts, if you have a beautiful bounty, have no shame. Just make sure you maintain. Because the different kinds of bras you wear in the long run will support you for when you get older because you know gravity just takes over when you get older i am sweating <laughs> gravity takes over when you get older so now is the time to wear those support bras and keep them suckers as lifted as as long as you can because unless you have plastic surgery or the money to get them um fixed then hey let nature take its course ladies don't be ashamed of your beautiful bounty just make sure you maintain it that's all i am saying and fellas don't be so hard on your girls when they got them big boobs and you be wanting to see them jiggle. just be kind to your girls fellas that's all it, it it hurts i'm sweating so bad right now but anyway, my boyfriend loves big boobs and he loves to play with mine. And I don't really like it unless he's, you know, getting real intimate and doing his thing with them. But if he's just doing this to him, I, I really don't like that because they're so heavy. I feel like I'm carrying another person sometimes. Y'all know what it's like. All you big breasted ladies out there that hear me talking, y'all know what it's like. Let me know in the comments if you feel me. If you feel me. But I shall be back. Okay. I'm back with my next bra that I want to show you, ladies. It's not so much as I want to show you my bra. Okay, let me take that back. I'm not showing you my bra. I'm showing you support versus non-support. Coverage versus non coverage now this is a full coverage bra also if you look at the straps here 
they're kind of thicker like they're all twisted but they're thicker up in here so that way I get that support that I need I get it so I'm happy but yeah this is what um support looks like ladies I'll do a 360 This one and the first black one that I had on, like if I was to go running down the stairs now, I'd feel the support. If I was to exercise or be running to catch a cab or a bus, I feel the support. I don't feel like they're gonna fall off of me. So that is so important. It's so important. I understand y'all ladies wanna look pretty, but I'm telling you, you're young now in your 20s, maybe even in your 30s. I'm in my 40s, okay? So I have some years on you ladies, and I know what I'm talking about when I say maintain them now because when you get to be my age, them suckers will droop very, 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 very much depending on the kind of bra you have. So support them suckers as long as you can. <gasps> it's so important, y'all. Listen, hey. Listen. Listen, okay? All right, support. I probably don't even look like I'm a, um, a triple D, but I am. <laughs> yeah, so this is support. This is what support looks like. Why do I still have this necklace on? You know what? I know why, because I'm sick. And I haven't done anything hardly, but I wanted to get this video out. I haven't cleaned. I haven't cooked. I haven't eaten. I have like days. No, it is not Corona. I've been tested. I got tested three days ago. I'm negative, but I've been fighting this cold that I've had for the longest. And yeah, I just didn't want to take, I don't know if I didn't want to take it off or, you know, I'm going to take it off. If I can, because it's not matching nothing I got on. I mean, if I could get it off, let's see. Let's see here. And then I got these nails on. They are not helping. Just a little far out of there. Yeah, these nails not gonna let me get this thing off of me. Not today. I'm sorry, y'all. Just, I mean, I know it don't match, but whatever. I just don't feel good, so I'm just trying to get this out. So please just bear with me, but this is support, ladies. I got support. I could bounce up and down. Now, I'm gonna get into padded bras. Because when you got boobs like this, you don't need padded bras. But we're gonna get into them right after this. Okay, you guys, talk about padded bras. Okay, this is lightly padded. I don't get a full padded bra if I'm a triple D. Now, if I was an eight cup, or a B cup, or maybe even a C cup, I probably would get a padded bra to make my breasts look bigger and more voluptuous, but I don't need that. So, this bra is lightly padded. It does have some padding in it, but I'm not really fond of this bra, and I'm gonna tell you guys why. Look, it doesn't have the thick straps, so, I think this is actually the bra that's digging in my shoulders, if I'm not mistaken. I think it is this bra. But yeah, this bra right here is padded lightly. And it does have the three, no it has four, I think it has four claps here. So the four claps. Gives me the support that I need in the back. 
and the full coverage gives me the support I need in the front. But this doesn't give me the support that I need for my shoulders. It's really important, ladies, that you just don't worry about covering your breasts. You have to pay attention to your shoulders, too, because that's what is supporting you, not to mention your back. So the more you support your breasts, your back is going to thank you for one. For two, when you get older, gravity won't take over as much. And for three, it looks good. It just looks better to just have a solid pair of breasts, you know? So support them. I'm going to keep saying that as much as I can, ladies. Support your boobs, okay? This is not a full coverage bra. These straps, they dig. And because I have all the weight here, it just pulls them down. There's nothing. So, yeah. This bra is it's not a winner. Not a winner. All right. I'm going to be back with a strapless bra. Strapless bra. I want to show you guys the difference between strapless bras and what you should do when you have a strapless bra, a convertible strapless bra, what you should do, because that's what I have. I have a convertible strapless bra. So I'm going to change bras real quick. Probably give me something to drink because I'm melting. Yeah, melting. And I should be back. Okay. First of all, ladies, when you have a convertible bra, they come with straps that you can you know put one strap here or if you have a halter top on you can put the straps to go this way or you can wear them regularly like a bra wear those straps hopefully you have a convertible the convertible bra with the clear straps now every time i do a video because i do hauls you guys know if you watch my channel if you don't shame on you y'all should be subscribing because I bring you guys what is popping. Y'all didn't hit that subscribe button yet? Y'all didn't hit that notification bell? What you, were what you waiting for? <laughs> Go ahead. Yeah. It's okay. It's free. Go ahead. Alright, so. This bra, I have two. I have this beige one and then I have a black one. Now. I got clear straps that went with the black one and the the um, tan one. And when I do my hauls, I wear them because, as you can see, I will fall out. I, I will seriously, like, just fall out. Like, if I start jumping around, I might stay in, but I don't know. I just, I don't feel secure. I don't feel like, like I'm, 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 I'm hugged. I don't feel like my boobs are hugged. And the best kind, well, of course, is going to be padded because that's the way that it, it stays around you. But that's the best kind to get is as is, is heavy padded as you can if you have big breasts. Because you want that support and still want to look cute even though you're wearing something that doesn't have sleeves. Or if you're wearing a halter top or anything like that, you want to make sure that your Breasts are not going to just fall out. Now, if you look here from the side, you see I have no spillage. I actually got this bra from Catherine's. It was quite pricey. But that's another thing we're going to get into. Don't go cheap, y'all. If you have big breasts, I've done the cheap eBay way. I've done the Walmart way. I've done the Kmart way. I, it... To maintain means to spend some money. And if, if if you ladies can wear Fenty X and Victoria's Secret, I'm not mad at you. I'm happy for you. But I can't, ma'am. I, I, I can't do it. Fenty doesn't have my size. Victoria's Secret doesn't have my size. They don't even come. I think they do have a double. They got double D's. I don't think they have triple D's. And I'm a 46 triple D because I'm a big plus size beautiful diva. So I'm just like, okay, I have to spend some money. So I go to Lane Bryan and spend 60 bucks on one bra. <laughs> 60 bucks on one bra. 
But it is so worth it because not only is that bra gonna Okay. I had to um I had to sit down for a minute. My sugar feels like it's low. I'm diabetic and my sugar feels like it's low and I felt really faint and I did not want to fall out on camera and have my phone sitting way up here and me not being able to dial 911. So I just sat my ass down for a minute and I feel better. But what I was saying was don't go cheap. If you want that support, you're going to have to spend some coins. Now, I don't mean no disrespect, and I'm not throwing no shade on Fenty. I'm not throwing no shade on Adore Me. I'm not throwing no shade on Victoria's Secret. But I can't wear them. <laughs> I can't wear them. So I'm just like, okay, um, 60 bucks for a bra. Yeah. And I don't regret it because most of my bras are supportive. The ones that I was trying out, trying to be cute, give me no support. And they dig into my shoulders. And now I have dark spots, dark grooves in my shoulders from where it just like dug into my shoulders. Me trying to be cute. So now, uh, like granny panties, I guess you can call them. I don't do fancy bras. I just do regular bras, you know. 18, not 18 hour, but um, Playtex, I think the brown, the tan one was a Playtex, the pink one I got from Avenue, and that was the one I was trying to be cute in, and yeah, that, yeah. Anywho, this is going to be my last one, ladies. So, if you get yourself a strapless bra, make sure you wear your straps. They're clear for a reason. They're clear so that you can wear your little cute, you know, um, sleeveless dress or sleeveless top or halter top or, you know, dress with your back out. They do that for a reason because if you wear the straps, you know, depending on what you're wearing, it will support your breasts. And that's what you want most of all. I know you want to look cute, but you want support for your breasts, you guys. That's what you want. You want support for your breasts. So, I don't know what else to tell you. Take care of them and they'll take care of you. That's, that's, that's basically the end result. If you take care of them, they will take care of you. And you can um, take that to the bank. Actually, you can have that mean anything you want it to mean. That they will take care of you. I thought I heard somebody come in my front door. <laughs> my boyfriend don't get off from work until 6. And I think it's only like 4. So yeah, shouldn't be nobody coming up in here. Alright you guys, I'm going to get out of here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see more videos like this. My wig reviews. My clothing hauls. My beautiful face. Hit that subscribe button. And smash that notification bell. So you do not miss any of my other uploads. Also, it helps. YouTube, it helps my channel on YouTube with the algorithm. I'm trying to get the algorithm to push my videos. So I need more audience engagement. That's what I'm trying to get is the audience engagement. So send me a message or comment. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> no, but um, I'm going to get out of here and I will see you guys in another one. I love you to the moon and back and bye.